Welcome back to the prayer link. Before we go, here's the word of the week from our friend, Brenda Crouch. Hi, Prayer Link family. John 12 gives an account of Jesus returning to Bethany where he had recently raised Lazarus from the dead. It was just six days before Passover when Jesus would soon be turned over to be crucified. The scriptures tell us that while Martha served him a meal and Lazarus sat at the table with him, Mary anointed his feet with a pound of costly spikenard oil and she wiped them with her hair. The whole house was filled with the fragrance of this oil that later followed Jesus to the cross. When worship comes from recognizing the value of our Redeemer, our treasures are changed and the atmosphere becomes fragrant with his beauty. But in that same moment, Judas Iscariot, who would soon betray Jesus, became angry, trying to humiliate Mary for wasting such a costly oil which could have been sold for the poor. But Jesus said to Judas, leave her alone. She has kept this for the day of my burial. True worship comes with the reality of grief, understanding that the corruption of death is inescapable without the Christ who redeems us and gives us his resurrection life. We are called to identify with the death, burial, and resurrection of the Lord so that we might come up from our own grave changed and made new. But this understanding is only made possible by the Spirit of the Lord who reveals the great mysteries of God in the hardest of places. Be blessed today. You are loved. I'm Brenda Crouch. So much, Brenda, the power of the cross 